we've seen both innings, but he's gone and taken nine for 43 here. I think it's kind of presence of greatness. So you don't want to take anyone for granted, but it must give you a great feeling that you just you just know he's going to do it nearly all the time. Yeah, and his record suggests just that, doesn't it? I mean, what Hunt, you know, he didn't disappoint, did he? He bowled exceptionally well. Um, in in those conditions, it must have been very difficult to, to come up against that. Um, and it's, I suppose, a really pleasing thing throughout this series is we're not relying on one individual. You know, every guy within that attack is, has put in crucial performances throughout the two games. So that's a really, uh, a really good thing for this team, you know, and stands in really good stead. Gives us a huge amount of confidence going into the last three games. So, but just as a captain, though, how do you harness that when you suddenly sense he, he, he's he's on that role again? I think special commodity, isn't he? Something that doesn't come along very often. And, We've got to enjoy him while he's around. Um, uh, there's been chat about him and his longevity, but at the minute he seems to be bowling better than he ever has before. And uh, even though the conditions suited, you've still got to go and put the ball in the right areas, ask the right questions of the batters. And yes. you know, well, obviously that's the that would be the dream, wouldn't it, to to put in five complete performances and and have five wins. But as I said, it's important that you we don't get complacent, arrogant, or look too far ahead uh, we're playing against the number one side in the world with some very talented players and um, we have to make sure that we continue to keep looking to learn and develop as a team we're not the finished article we've got a long way to go to where we want to get to um, and you know we're going to have to start again and work extremely hard over the next five days to win the next game um, and it's that's got to be our mentality moving forward ये जो दूसरे मैच में पहले इनिंग में डेफिनेटली बोलर्स के लिए फेवरेबल थी लेकिन दूसरे इनिंग में क्या हम कुछ डिफरेंट कर सकते थे नहीं काफी लोग कंडीशंस के बारे में बात कर रहे हैं कि हमने मुश्किल टाइम पे बैटिंग किया फिर जो दिन अच्छा दिस इज द फर्स्ट टाइम इन द लास्ट 5 टेस्ट दैट वी बीन रियली आउटप्लेड यू नो वी हैवंट बीन आउटप्लेड वी हैव कंपीटेड इन एवरी गेम सो वी विल हैव टू एक्सेप्ट दैट side like england when they play like that they can outplay any opposition especially when they play at home and you know the ball is doing a bit so we'll have to accept that put it on the side and improve in the next game as a general rule how do you think indian batsmen can improve there is five days um before the next test and we we confident with rehab and strengthening i should be ready for the next game although not the same intensity in the field but you know i should be good enough to hold a position in the field and and be 100% uh, with the bat again i'll have to look at the running bit of things which was difficult today but yeah as of now it's, it's